Okay, we're coming to you live from the little red wagon today. And this is our third take because we've had several interruptions. Uh, it's our kids. Uh, you know, they're our responsibility. <laughs> okay. Um, first of all, we need to talk. We need to define responsibility. <laughs> Tori, do you have a definition of responsibility? And no. You don't? Mm -mm. <laughs> okay. Being responsible means you are responsible for your own actions. It's nobody else's fault but your own. If you put yourself in some kind of situation where you get in trouble, where you go to jailbirds, things of that nature. Get someone pregnant. It's not your mama's fault. I mean, well, I'm just going to do a little touch base on birth control here. Your parents can preach birth control to you all they want, but they can't be right there and put the condom on for you. Unless you just want them tagging along. Which I'm not doing. So, so what anyway. we're saying is if you get a girl pregnant, it is your responsibility to take care of the child. Yes, that's very important. Okay, let's go on to, um, let's see, what else we need to talk about. Just little things like, for example, I mean, if you eat at somebody else's house... Rake your plate out. Rinse it off before you put it in the sink. Don't just freaking leave it over there on the damn counter for somebody else to pick up. My Lord, that kind of crap just tacks me off. Or like me, like if I go over to Tamara's and I spend the night, what do I do when I get up in the morning? I usually make my bed. Yeah. She can verify that I do do that. Because yes. I was taught as a young child that to pick up after yourself, to, you know, clean up after yourself. Little things like that. If you dump the ice trays, fill them back up. If you throw a piece of toilet paper in the trash can and it kind of tumbles off into the floor, it's your responsibility to go ahead and tie her up, <laughs> go put it somewhere else, and put a new one in it. Don't just push it on down in there. That's what we're talking about. Taking responsibility for your own actions. Cleaning up after yourself. That's all it is. And I think a lot of the problem with people today is they don't want to take responsibility if they get in some kind of predicament or in trouble i mean it's everybody's fault they'll go all the way back to their great 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 grandpa and blame it on them and it's time to man up grow some gonads and take care of your own crap all you have to do is say i did it it's my fault uh i'm sorry you know, take ownership for your actions. Yeah. If you get pulled over by the lawman and you got some weed or, you know, some crank underneath your seat. Or paraphernalia. Paraphernalia, anything. Man, don't be trying to blame it on this passenger over here when it is under your seat and in your car. Don't be trying to blame it on Bob over here. And, you know, I always joke and make fun, like saying, hey, <coughs> I'm going to get in jailbirds, blah, blah, blah. I ain't saying I'm never going to get in jailbirds, but